Welcome to Minehead and the start of the Southwest Coast Path. I'm just leaving Minehead behind me now. It was a little bit windy, a little bit busy back there, so I've just waited till I got out a bit till uh, I could start filming. But uh, the big one, the Southwest Coast Path, 630 miles. I am so excited to be here because I've been planning this for about two years almost. So I'm just here for five days on this short trip, taking it to Barnstable. Uh, just a day pack on this one because in two weeks time I've got a two week break between this trip and the next trip and the next trip I'll be on trail for a month uh, and I didn't want to carry any niggling injuries from this trip into that one to ruin that month off so I'm just taking short miles this week to Barnstable over five days I think it is and then I'll be back with the big camping gear in three weeks from now uh, to carry on from Barnstable and see how far I can get in a month <laughs> talking to camera too much today because it's just been too windy you wouldn't have heard a thing well England are playing tonight so I've got to find a pub that's got football on so I will see you tomorrow good morning I'm just leaving Porlock behind where I spent the night it's a lovely beautifully little maintained village uh, there's a camp uh, campsite there Spark Hayes campsite they will take backpackers on demand um, there's a couple of pubs in the high street small fish and chip restaurant pharmacy good sized supermarket to resupply um, and there's a little hardware store there, a village hardware that store that probably sells everything. So if you've forgotten the gas for your stove, you can probably pick some up in there. Four candles, some O's, and some pumps. Um, 
11 miles to do today to Linton and Linmouth. Linmouth. Only a short day because I went to Linmouth over 10 years ago now and I thought it was beautiful and we didn't stay very long at all. So I promised myself I'll come back and have a good look around one day. So today's that day. I am on a beach for the first time. I mean, it's not Barbados, but have a look. When you've watched as many South West Coast Park videos as I have, you know behind me, Coburn Church is a pretty iconic place. So I'm gonna go and have a visit there now. This is Coburn Church. It's tiny, I believe. I remember hearing something that says the, one of the oldest churches in the country, still in use. I could be wrong, but I remember hearing something like that. But it's tiny. Literally you can walk from the front to the back in just a few paces. So I've just read it's actually 900 years old. That's old. It's worth a little look inside that church when you get there, it's lovely. Because it was Sunday, I'd put my ear to the door to make sure there wasn't a service going on. I don't know what time kickoff is in the church on Sunday, but I thought I'd better be careful. But it looks like it's closed, but just push the door, it's open. It's very nice. Yeah, about 900 years old, apparently. It shows it. <laughs> This here can probably stand for another 900 years, that. Huh? It's lovely from time to time hearing the sea crash against the, uh, the shoreline. Problem is you never get to see it, you're always so far away from it. But I think tomorrow I should be a lot nearer the coast and on some bigger rocks and see the, the waves crashing into the rocks. But pretty much the whole trip so far, it's, you've, you've been away from the coast. So it's still something to look forward to, but it doesn't really feel like a coast walk.
This is the first big panoramic shot I've had of the coast since I've been on it. It's lovely. The bay back there is Porlock. That's where I started today. On the whole, it's been very easy going. But the coombe just behind these trees, that's been the hardest part of the day. That's beautiful. What a lovely day. Not quite so windy as well. Very windy, I do apologise, but uh, it's my first sight of Linton on top of the hill there and Linmouth in the bay. Oh, I'm out of breath, there's some real big coombs to get up and down here. I'm actually about two miles further back than I thought I was. Because I've been in the trees all day, you can't see any visible landmarks, and you've no idea where you are, you just have to guess. If you can see over my shoulder there that walk into Lynmouth and Linton it's very exposed really windy if you don't like heights you're not going to like that bit so I'm just coming into Linton and there appears to be something going on I think it's some kind of car show there goes my quiet little <laughs> I can't believe it my quiet little afternoon in Linton out the window <laughs> 10 years I've been waiting to come back for this lovely little quiet village <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Let's have a see what's uh, have a look what's going on. But it looks like a oh yeah, it does look like a car show. I work on cars for a living. You think I'd be interested, but when you work on cars for a living, the last thing I care about is cars. But look at this; it's beautiful. It's a. Did you call it a coombe or a valley? Is it a coombe by the coast? But it's just a beautiful place. Okay, Ashley, thank you very, very much for doing that. Ladies and gentlemen, can I just say that um, Dark Radio has been around for the Lynn Valley. What are the odds? Um, since the it's our absolute I'll show you some more when I get in the town. I'm not gonna lie, I was gonna take that cliff top railway to the top, but the queues, because of this car show, are huge. Not because I wanted to cut out this hill and be true to the path, but because I just wanted to do it. When, I, when am I gonna be back here again to do that cliff top railway? But the queues were so big, I'd have waited there for an hour. But this hill from Lynmouth up to Linton, my God, it's steep. This has got to be the steepest thing you walk on the southwest coast, was. I can't imagine anything worse. That won't really give you an idea, <laughs> but it's got to be 40, 45 degrees at points at least. It's a beast. I'm glad I didn't have one, more than one pint in, Lim, in Lynmouth. 
can't even talk. I'm so out of breath. Oh. That's the end of day two at Linton. Thanks for watching this video. Join me in the next one. Thanks very much.